Hello, Infos. Welcome back to another episode of uh, Uncharted 3. I've done like five episodes in one day. So, when we left off, uh, this man was about to shoot me. Let's go. This won't hurt a bit. Oh. Oh. He's dead. Ooh. Nice revolver, Sully. Am I? Am I? Hmm. It's a diner. You can relax, kid. We're safe here. Are we? Go on. I don't trust you. Suit yourself. If you don't want it. Nope, mine. My food. Nom, nom, nom. What do you want from me? Hmm. A little gratitude would be nice. I did just save your ass back there. Oh, yeah, you yeah, did. Thanks. But what's in it for you? I mean, you're a crook, right? <laughs> you gotta have an angle. <laughs> you are one piece of work, kid. What's your story, anyway? Look, mister. No offense, but I don't even know you. Easily remedy. Victor Solomon. This should be the part where you introduce yourself. Nope. Okay. Suppose you tell me what's so special about that ring. It's mine. It belongs in my family. I'm just taking it back. Passed down from Francis Drake himself. That's right. I don't know how to break this to you, kid, but Drake didn't have any heirs. No children. Well, not with his wife back in England, anyway. <laughs> okay, good point. Let me see it. No. Oh, kid, if I was going to take it from you, I would have done it by now. Hmm, good point. Thank you. You're welcome. So, what is this? Parvis? Sick Parvis Magna. It means greatness from small beginnings. That was his motto. Yeah? You see, Queen Elizabeth gave it to him in 1581, when he got back to England after circumnavigating the globe. That's when she made him a knight. He sure as hell didn't learn that on the streets. <laughs> no. How's a kid your age know Latin? The nuns sort of insisted on it. Uh, so, like a boarding school? That's a nice word for it. Uh-oh. Okay, then. So what was all that business with the ring and that astrolabe thing back there? Why don't you tell me? You're the one working for him. Look, kid. The client wants something. I obtain it. For a price. I don't ask any questions. It's just a job. You look pretty friendly to me. Hey, uh, well. Anyway. I'm pretty sure I'm fired. Really? You don't say. Okay, look. First of all, that was no astrolabe. It's some sort of decoding device. Check this out. On his way around the world, Drake sailed through the East Indies. Only he says that it took him six months to get from here to here. Yeah, so? So it doesn't add up. He was way too good a sailor for that. It would have taken him a month. Tops. He was hiding something. Something big. How big? Like secret mission from the Queen big. Like millions in plunder treasure that hasn't ever been recovered big. big. That big? That big. And so that big. decoder has something to do with it. I would bet my life on it. Well, oh, well. And Marlowe's got it. Won't do her much good without the key. So it's a stalemate, then? For now. <laughs> so you still haven't told me what your name is? And 
you still haven't told me what you want from me. Okay. Look, you got talent, but you got a lot to learn. You stick with me and I'll teach you a few things. Thanks. But I'm doing just fine on my own. Yeah, clearly. What do you say we uh, try this again? My friends call me Sully. Nathan Drake. Nate. Drake, huh? Okay. I see great things in our future, kid. Great things. It's taking five minutes to talk. Oh, here we go. You're dead. You're dead. And there you go. You were gonna put a silencer on that thing. Sally, you've got no sense of drama. Right. <laughs> All right. Well, that racket's gonna bring the cops any minute. Get the hell out of here. <sighs> Could have pulled a couple of those punches, Charlie. What do you mean? I hardly touched you. You headbutted me. <laughs> All right. All right. I got a little swept up in the moment. Huh? You were the one who said make it look realistic. Better stay on this good side. All right, Broad Ice. Look sharp. They're coming your way. Don't lose them. I told you they take the bait. How long do you reckon before they realize this is a fight? Who cares? We finally flushed them out. And now we just follow them back to their hole. Yep. I do realize you're making everything sound dirty. Eh. <laughs> that was funny. All right, Nathan Drake. Wow! Let's get moving. Have a grow. No. What? Shit. The mother. This way. Really? All right. Made it. Come on, Charlie. What's the hold up? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, all right. He's claustrophobic. <laughs> It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, that wasn't too bad. What the hell is wrong with you? Nothing. I'm fine. All right. Just gotta climb this fence. Go. That's blocked. Wait. We can get around this way. Yeah, yeah, right. Or we could just use a little muscle. Oh. Oh. That works There's too. A thought. That works too. Ugh. Yeah. We. Goes too high. Yeah. Let's move this thing over there. Okay. I got it. Put your back into it, mate. We haven't got a bloody night. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Huh. Come on, move your lazy asses. Man. All right. Looks like the coast is clear. It's blurring up. Here we go. Sorry if you can't see it that well. You should be more careful with your head, you know. <laughs> Chloe! Good evening, lads. All right, darling. Chloe. Looks like hell spit you two back out. She's uh, in the I second one. I went off without a hitch. You're unusually quiet. What's up your bum? Oh, well, Charlie seemed to... Enjoy yourself a little bit too much for my taste. Uh, <laughs> my ears are still ringing. Oh, for God's sake. Helps if you have something in between. <laughs> oh, it looks like I missed out on some fun. Yeah, you did, actually. It was very, very uh, cathartic. Uh, it's funny. Do you have any trouble? Nah, <sighs> easy peasy. And you're sure they didn't see you trailing them? Not a chance. Sorry, which door's scary popping slightly behind? Behind that one there, the green one. <gasps> they drove in ages ago, and it's been dark ever since. You think they're still in there? Well. I haven't taken my eyes off it. And no one's gone in. Flashlights. And guns. Think these are really necessary? I mean, it's not like they're expecting us. Don't underestimate these blokes. They're not messing about. Hey, we're just going to sneak in. And we sneak up. Just like that. Guns. Yeah, fair enough. But any trouble, just... you shoot first and ask questions later, all right? All right, let's do this. Man, I was sorely tempted to just pick up that briefcase back there and walk. Yeah, you got a lousy public placement. Hey, trust me, that's nothing compared to what we're on to. Yeah, well, at my age, a bird in the hand, you know. Ew. Didn't I tell you? Oh, please. Look, I just hope you're right about this. Hey, Chloe. What's up? Oh, yeah, that's a nice view. pretty quiet. <laughs> Excuse 
Excuse me, Sully. I'm going in. You think they're still in there? We're not gonna just barge in the front door and find out. Well, we can't afford to waste time standing there. I'll find a way in and check it out. You three stay here. Here we go. No, never mind. I'll go a little bit longer. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah. Sorry about that. Eh. Oh god, yes. Okay. Oh. Oh. Wait, no, 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 no. No, no. Okay, go, go. Hello, birdies. Hello, birdies. My satellite dish. What are you doing? All right. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Ooh! Ouchies! Guys, I'll see you later.